So in today's video I'm making a lot of changes and saying goodbye, sadly, to a lot of fish. So before we get going with this video, just giving you a look at the 10 gallon planter tank. The BBA seems to be on the decline and the plants have actually been growing really, really nicely recently. Quick question, what stock could I add in this tank? Some more black neons, a German blue female for the male. All thoughts I've had, so let me know in the comments. So anyway, enough of that, let's get this video going. So. The other day I went to the store and I decided I had to get rid of some of my bigger Africans just because they were just getting too big for the tank and I've kind of been talking on my channel about doing something different for a while. And I've been talking about doing these different things because of these guys here. These are blue neon juveniles that have been growing out for the last few months and although they are doing well, I kind of just want to do something a little bit different to just keep in fish and get back into breeding these a Lunacara, Stuart Granty, Blue Neon Cichlids. However, in order to do that, it means I have to get rid of some of my bigger male African cichlids and it was a tough decision with the tank looking as good as it is right now, but for the, for the greater good, I feel like I just had to do it and a lot of the big guys that you see here have been sold. The ones I am keeping however is this little star sapphire, the smaller blue neons that are already in there, that albino who's been looking really really awesome recently and I'm also keeping the wife's blood parrot just because it's the wife's blood parrot and then this little ruby crystal peacock. So this is the last time you'll see this 55 gallon African cichlid tank looking like this and we took them to the fish store to be sold. So while we were there, we happened to see something that we weren't really expecting. That's obviously Wet Pets and Friends that we've talked about before, and that's where I sell the majority of the blue neon fry when I've got some to sell. But we came back from the fish store with a bag after... One of the employees told me that while he was looking at a tank the other day, he noticed that there was one that had been brought in, which was a blue neon. There's no blue neons in the area and he specifically remembers this guy that brought the blue neon in buying six of them at the time he said he were putting it in a 220 and for some odd reason he brought it back so in the 55 gallon tank now i happen to have one of my blue neons that is now about that big as he's been in a bigger tank to a lot of my guys and it's just, I mean, it's just changed the game. So I'm going to get back into breeding mode and we're going to breed these blue neons and we're going to ship them all over the US because I've got a fair few people on Instagram. If you don't follow me, follow me Cichlidscape on there as well, who would be interested in these guys. So let's take a look at the new little breeder male. But first, let's look at this guy's father, who's just an absolute stud. Some of his little siblings there, as well as in here in this little 55. And then, oh, for his size, his coloration is really, really nice. And currently there's still a few bigger fish in the tank that I need to sell. And he's, he's doing pretty good. So I'm really, really looking forward to getting the bigger fish out of this tank and watching him colour up. And this tank is then going to become a 55 gallon African cichlid breeder tank. And the 29 gallon that you just looked at is going to be a grow out for fry before I sell them all over the country. If you're interested in it, let me know in the comments. I'd love to get a gauge on how many people are interested in these fish. Absolutely awesome fish, great coloration. And this is how the tank's looking right now. I've still got to sell a few more fish. We're gonna see how the blood parrot does in there. Obviously the wife doesn't want me to sell him, but time will tell. So this is what we're doing now. This is the new focus. And these fish will be available for you guys soon. Thanks for watching.